Today's video is all about doing the KO Preco heist with the Annihilator, because I feel like the Annihilator just doesn't get enough love when it comes to the KO Preco heist. And I thought, you know what? I want to do a video on it. I did one in my spin the wheel video, so I wanted to test it out again. Because in that video, if you saw it, I had to go in the drainage tunnel. So I basically landed the helicopter, the Annihilator. Oh, I got out the Annihilator, and then I had to jump in the water right away. So this time, I wanted to try doing it a little bit differently. And I thought, okay, what else isn't... What, what is something else that I don't really see very often? Look at this view, by the way. Isn't... <laughs> GTA is gorgeous, man. Uh, what is something else that I don't see a lot of in KO Perico videos? And that's the grappling hook. So I decided we're going to do the Annihilator coming in, and then we're going to go get the grappling hook, and then we'll just get... That's, the, uh, that's all I have. <laughs> that's the idea of the video. I want to do the KO with the Annihilator and with the, uh, with the grappling hook. So that's what we're doing. Let's do it. And we've only gone and bloody got the ruby necklace. Take a look at that badger. Finally, some indecent. I say finally. We had the, uh, what should we call it? The, the, uh, what's it called, man? The bearer bonds. We had the bearer bonds for a while, which are technically better. So I'm not going to complain. We haven't really had the tequila in a while, so I'm not worried. But anyway, as you can see, we've got the stealth annihilator. Uh, infiltration point is obviously the drop zone because we have no other choice. The compound entry point, we're going to say drainage, but it's not going to be that. We're going to use a grappling hook. Uh, escape point. We're going to just do our basic escape point. This isn't a spin the wheel video. If you want to check those out, if you don't know what I'm talking about, by the way, when I say spin the wheel, uh, I'll throw up a little video or picture on screen here. We essentially spin the wheel and that determines how we do the entire, the entire heist from the entry vehicle to the exit point to the entry point to like everything in that spin the wheel series. So if you haven't seen it, I'll leave a link to the end of this video and in the description if you want to go just watch some fun, completely random KO Preco videos. Uh, but anyway, this video is not one of those, so I can leave wherever I want to leave. So we're going to leave on the bottom, uh, which I'll show you guys here in a little bit, so I can put that on anything. Time of day is daytime, just so I can see what I'm doing, and I think it looks better in a video when it's daytime. Weapon loadout, we're going for the marksman with suppressor, and that's it. So let's just go ahead and jump into it. All right, and here we go, ladies and gentlemen. So I will say, I did, uh, I scouted the island, obviously, beforehand, just to make sure that I could do this and not be running around like an idiot for an hour trying to do it. Uh, so I know where there's going to be a grappling hook. What's he on about? I also don't understand why I say the pilot is disabled stealth mode when he's coming up to it. Shouldn't he be enabling stealth mode when he's coming up to it? Is it just me? Maybe it's just me. But anyway, essentially what it is we're trying to do here is we're just going to be doing it a little bit different. You know what I mean? The KO Perico heist. That's why I initially started the Spin the Wheel series. Is because I love doing the KO Perico. And, you know, I just don't want it to be repetitive. Me doing the same thing over and over again. So the Spin the Wheel series forces me to do things different every single time. Um, so because of that, I learned about, you know, the Annihilator and doing this entry point. Do I think it's incredible? No. Um, there's definitely better ways to do the KO Perico heist. Obviously the Long Fin. Or the Kasatka. But this one is just, it's different, right? We're doing something a little bit different. Hopefully it's a video that, you know, you don't see much of. So let's go ahead, grapple down here. Which again, is pretty cool. I <laughs> I still think this way of coming in is kind of, kind of pointless, but it's okay. So also for secondary, we want, we want to get the elite challenge. So that's the whole point in this, right? We want the elite challenge by coming in with the annihilator. So like I say, I've already scouted out where we're going for the cutting, uh, not the cutting torch, the grappling hook, which is actually going to be in this area over here, which again, in all honesty, I didn't even realize there's going to be a car coming up here soon, I'm sure of it. Uh, I didn't even realize there was loot over here. So that's where we're going to be getting our first set of loot. Okay, there is a car. Is that a car or is that a sniper? I don't know. Let's stay out of the way of him. Okay, which way is that car going? Left or right? Is he going left? Oh, okay. don't see me. I risked that a little bit too much there, I'll be honest. Okay, I think we can sneak up here now. See, I didn't even realize there was loot over here. Oh, God. I'm like, I'm like, <laughs> okay, let's just go. Uh, okay. Uh, I didn't even realize there was loot up here. You know what? We'll take out this guy. Just because I'm pretty sure. There we go. I'm pretty sure no cars are going to drive past this point. As I say that, is that a car coming? No. All right. All right, guys, you got to stop shouting random people. See, there's loot here. I didn't even realize there was bloody loot here. But this is what we're getting. Unfortunately, it looks like it's cash. But it's okay because I do have a painting in the main compound as well. So we should be able to fill up 
100% and get ourselves the elite challenge here. But like I say, the main thing was coming in with the Annihilator and also using the grappling hook because it's something that, in all honesty, it's kind of pointless. I think we can all agree it's kind of pointless. There's so much better ways to get into this compound than the bloody grappling hook. But you know what? It's something that's not done enough, if you ask me not done enough all right let's get back in our little motorcycle so i don't know if we're going to be able to do elite because that's obviously in less than 15 minutes and i am going to have to get a change of clothes too because with the grappling grappling the grappling hook all right this is actually a really important part i need to kill both of these guys without triggering the alarm so hold on a second uh oh we didn't do it. We did. I, this game, sometimes when you shoot multiple times like that in quick succession, it triggers them. Okay, so here's my grappling hook that I sourced earlier. So we're good to go. I don't think I need to kill that guy that's walking towards me. I don't think he's going to be knocking about. So let me just grab this and then try and avoid his cone of sight there. But yeah, like I was saying, can I squeeze through here somewhere? Please. Ow. I'm trying to get the elite challenge here. Yeah, so, anywho, like I was saying, um, in order to do the grappling hook, you need to get through the main gate. And the main gate, as we all know, is on... Is there a car? No, there's not. The main gate is on the other side of all the guards and things. So I need to get an outfit. Oh, there's definitely someone right there. Let's, it, let's avoid them. And there is a place over here on the left that usually has outfits. But I have scouted there earlier. And there wasn't one... Uh, there wasn't one there. So... I, we, we just have to go somewhere else. And that other place is this thing right in front of me. But as you can see... Ah, well, uh, uh. Hold on. Is this the place I want to go? I think it is. Or is it... No, it's actually over here. I did look over there too. There wasn't one there. I need to be quick though because I want to get the elite challenge. <laughs> I'm, I'm bloody rambling here too much. But yeah, to do the grappling hook, you need a change of outfit to get in there a little bit easier. There may be a point of entry on the fence somewhere that you could probably use. Um, but honestly, I, I didn't scout that far. I didn't, I didn't, my, my incredible skills of looking for this didn't go as far as to look if there was a better place. Okay, so I want to take out, there's a guy up top. But there's also a camera that doesn't show up until you get close. Okay, I kind of panicked there for a second, but we're good. We're good. We didn't spook any of the guards. So I need to get this outfit, which is right here. There we go. And people have asked me, like, sometimes they've copied my videos and they didn't see the outfit. Oh, and he's put that gun away. Put your gun away. If they see you with a gun once you've got the outfit, they will trigger the alarm. You can't have a gun on you. Uh, people have said they tried following my videos and the outfits weren't in the same place. Yeah, the outfits, they're always in the same place. Like, they, there's always an area where they will spawn, but it can be random. It can be random. And what I mean by that is it's, it's genuinely always the same area, but sometimes it'll be in a different spot versus... I, I'm going to have to do a video explaining it because I am awful at trying to explain that. I realize that. As I'm saying it out right now, it's, it's impossible for me to explain. Okay, so now we're coming in here nice and easy you just got to tap this gate which is kind of a, a weird mechanic they have but but this is why i think the gappling gappling grappling hook's stupid because you can just go through the side here and we're actually not going to be killing a single soul during this so all right so we're going in here with the grappling hook but you could just go through the side gate down there but you do have to kill people to do that and in this one we're not killing anyone except for that first guy who technically i didn't need to kill anyway well, here we go. <laughs> How often do you see this? You know what I mean? It's all about the gra 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 grappling hook, baby. Like I say, it's just something different. I wanted to do the Annihilator because I feel like it's never used or utilized enough. And I wanted to use the grappling hook because I don't think I've ever seen a video of people actually using the grappling hook. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to walk. These guys are having a little chat. I think we can run. But what we're going to do... So, you have to keep in mind, the jug will still see us. These red guards will still see us. Okay, so now he's moving. So, we're just going to go... It's just going to be the little stealthy maneuver, you know what I mean? We're just going to run around here. I mean, these guys are completely stupid. And we can all agree how stupid these guards are. I kind of don't want them to buff it, though. I don't want these guys to be any better than they are, because... It, <laughs> 
We, we already have a hard enough... I say we have a hard enough chance, uh, choice doing this. It's, it's pretty simple. Okay, then we're going to go up here. Now we can just get our... Well, our cash first and foremost. But as you can see here, I do have a painting, like I said. If I didn't have a painting here, we would have to go to another location to fill up our bag. Uh, since I haven't really been doing the wall glitches recently, I've had a lot of comments on the last video I did, people saying that the wall glitches... Um, the way that they used to happen, they made it a lot more difficult, but supposedly they're still available to do it. But in all honesty, I've been having so much fun still getting the Elite Challenge, just doing it the legitimate way. So, there's, uh, there's no point. But I will do a video on it if people are interested in it. Okay, so now we've got all of our secondary loot. Now we just need to go down and get our little a ruby necklace. Let me speed this up a little bit because there is three of them here. All oh, right, and just like that, we are in, ladies and gentlemen. So I am trying to keep myself fast here and not slow down and not dilly-dally on the way because I do want to get the Elite Challenge. I'm hoping... I don't know how much time that took me here at the beginning, getting the first secondary loot and the outfit and the... Uh, what should we call it? But it, I don't know how much time that took, so I'm going to try <laughs> my best to go a little bit faster here. All right. But yeah, I just think it's a little bit more fun to switch it up, you know what I mean? Let me know if there's any certain ways um, that you would like me to see me do this. There's so many different options and ways you can do the Capri Kais. That's another reason why I love it so much. It's just so different, and I love this island, and I... I don't know. It's just fun sneaking around, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, let me know if there's different ways that you would like me to try it. But anyway, now we need to go upstairs here, because we don't have a key to go out the other way. Now, this is where we just need to be a little bit more cautious, right? We don't want to spook the guards on the way out. The jug should probably... Yeah, he's right beneath us right now. So we're just going to wait for him to walk and turn. And also that guy that's facing forwards that's beneath us, you can see on the mini-map. Okay, now he's turned. We need the jug to turn, which he's just done. This guy's just an idiot and can't hear anything. We'll wait here, though. Just let the jug... See, there's another guy there that's looking this way. It's all about patience. Okay, so now we should be good to go. And we want to go on this side of the stairs, which we didn't. So this is great. Hurry up. The bloody guy's walking, my guy. Look on the mini-map. He's walking. Okay. So now, though, these guards won't trigger because we're wearing this cool little outfit. They may look like they're about to. Watch this. Nope, never mind. <laughs> They've done it before where they look like, but then they realize that I'm wearing their outfit and they're like, ah, no, he's cool. So this, I mean, this, I mean, I'm hoping we can get the uh, the uh, elite challenge here. But the grappling hook and thing, it's just fun. And if I can find, like I say, it's all about doing the elite challenge. And one of the reasons that I, let me, we'll actually kill this guy. Uh, one of the reasons that people, I think, really liked it when I showed them the wall glitch is so they could do it fast and get elite challenge. But if you can still get elite challenge... Doing it these fun and exciting ways. I recommend doing it the fun and exciting ways. This is why I love, like I say, the spin the wheel series I have so much. Just because it forces me to do it in ways that I would never, ever think to do it. Alright, I don't think we lost any cash there, Fallen. God, I hate the swimming mechanics in this game, man. When it just faces you the wrong way. Okay, so like I say, you can swim over to the three mines over there, but this is just the way I do it these days. I just always swim down here. It's just easier. It's just easier. All right, let's speed this up a little bit. All right. So it looks like my rebreather hasn't equipped for some reason. So I'm hoping... Okay, there we go. Rebreather. I was like, why, why do you have to wait until I'm like, looks like I'm almost dying to give it to me? And there you have it. <laughs> That was easy. That was easy. That was fun too, because it just forces you. Like, like a, how many of you do the grappling hook? I guarantee it's less than like 0.001% of people use the grappling hook. It's kind of stupid. There's better ways to do it, obviously. But it just spices things up a little bit. So let's see if we did get the elite challenge. We didn't get caught. We did get full bags. It's the 15 minute part that I'm kind of worried about because I don't know how long that took us here at the beginning. So 100% of the take. Elite challenge. 12 minutes. I, right, I'll take it. Zero hacks failed. We are ready to go. Full loot bags. Yes, indeed. So we passed it, right? 
All right, there we have it. Ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoyed, please hit the like button. You know what? 91% of you are not subscribed. <laughs> I always hear YouTubers being like, oh, 50% of you. 91%! Please subscribe. I'd appreciate it. Uh, but like if you enjoy, share it if you want, and I will see you guys tomorrow with a brand new video. Cheers.